In this lecture, I am going to discuss about how to find the integration of 4x cube plus 3x square plus 2x plus 1 uh, bracket dx. So here, let's uh, see the answer. So here, we just uh, write the given first. The given is integration symbol, write that here, 4x cube plus 3x square plus 2x plus 1 here is the bracket dx so this is the first question of the integration I will discuss more so let's do the separately so first is for 4x, 3x, 2x and 1 so writing here integration 4x cube integration 3 so here you should must include you must include here or dx part also dx next bracket 3x square dx and uh, bracket 2x dx and uh, here we can write so x to the power 0 the value is 1 and here 1 dx now here or 4, 3, 2 that's all our constants so constant must be right on the first so we can write here for x cube dx plus 3 x square dx 2 x dx here plus and uh, integration x power 0 dx now here the first uh, formula of the integration we should use if integration x power n dx is there so x n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 this is the f important formula that we use in this question so n is any or uh, integer positive or negative so here let's write for x 3 plus 1 divided by 3 plus 1 so here 3 put the value 3 dx 3 plus 1 divided by 3 plus 1 here 3 x 2 plus 1 divided by 2 plus 1 2 x 1 power 1 is there 1 plus 1 divided by 1 plus 1 x power 0 here 1 should be add 0 plus 1 ok so here is so uh, 1 x to the power 0 value also 1 so 1 into 1 there is no any effect now here 4 x power 4 here divide by 4 next 3 x power 3 divided by 3 thereafter 2 x s square divided by 2 next x power 1 and to after doing this there must be include one constant that called c here c c is the constant so 3 cancel 2 cancel 4 cancel finally here the output is x power 4 x cube x square x plus c is our answer of this question one time going to repeat write the given integration so this is the given here 4x cube now let's do the separate so this part separate this one this one this one separated constant write the first and after that use this formula and to after doing that here you can see or do some calculation and after here this is the simplest form of this question so this is the way we are doing the integration of this question so this is the first question 
I will discuss more. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.